Do you think it's possible the Browns uh, invest in some offensive linemen? I know, you know, I know they're young. I know they're deep. But if you think back to to the uh, the playoff game, we had a guy playing guard who literally, you know, yeah, Baker Mayfield said he kind of came in and introduced himself to me before the the game in the locker room. It's the first time I met him. So you can never have enough offensive line. I think they'll look at a guy late for sure. I think they like Drew Forbes. People have sort of forgot about Drew Forbes, who was, uh, I think, I think Drew was their sixth round pick in 2019, sat out last year on the COVID list, made that choice for himself. Um, I think that they still want to look at, they, I mean, they obviously liked Kendall Lamb, but lost him to free agency. They still have Chris Hubbard who can play. Chris showed he can play all over the place. Uh, they definitely have, uh, you know, Nick Harris is still a, a young player that they they think can be a future center for them. But I do think they would be wise as, listen, Joel Batonio, who I think wants to probably retire at Cleveland Brown at this juncture. I, I, I hope that works out, but you never know. Uh, Joel's in his 30s and J.C. Treader's getting there and he's he's had a lot of injury issues too. So they have to continue to supplement pieces on the offensive line, look at developing down the line talent. And that's where I think if they if potentially, Dave, they, especially if they trade down, maybe they trade down to the mid 30s and pick up an extra third and an extra fifth. That's where you could see them target an offensive lineman somewhere. So if they took a back half of the draft offensive lineman, I would not be surprised in the slightest bit because I do think it's wise to continue to invest mid to late round picks in offensive linemen that you can develop. And especially with Bill Callahan, who is a, a you just don't know how long Bill will be your offensive line coach. And while you can get him to get some of these young players in and develop them and give them some of the things he knows while he's here, that's great. And that's something you want. So I, 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 at this point, I'm expecting them to take some sort of offensive lineman later in the draft.